In this lecture, we will understand what to do with our legacy FMEAs and scenarios when new FMEAs are actually needed. Many of you must have already been following the FMEAs as per the AIAG 4th edition and now when I talked about the key changes in the 5th edition, you must already be confused as to what will happen to all those old FMEAs. Should I be changing them? Should I be reformatting them into the new template, etc. So I want to add a quick note here, thereby reducing the anxiety for you. Here are the guidelines as per AIAG for transition to the new format. Existing FMEAs don't require to be changed. If you have an existing DFMEA, PFMEA for an existing process or for a product which is already in force, you could continue to maintain them in the old format. 